Understanding Barn Red. Hello, dear learners. Today, we're diving into the picturesque world of English phrases by discussing the term barn red. It's a colorful term, both literally and figuratively. Let's unpack its meaning and learn how it's used in the English language. At first glance, barn red consists of two familiar words. Barn, a large farm building used for storing grain, hay, or straw or for housing livestock. Red, a color at the end of the spectrum next to orange and opposite violet. When combined, however, they don't just describe any red-colored barn. Barn red is a specific shade of red. It's a deep, muted, and rich red that you might see on many traditional barns across rural landscapes, particularly in the United States. The tradition of painting barns this particular shade has a historical background. In the past, farmers would paint their barns with a mixture of linseed oil, milk, and ferrous oxide, or rust. This mixture was both inexpensive and durable. The ferrous oxide gave the paint its distinctive red color, and also protected the wood from mold and moss. Over time, this shade of red became iconic and synonymous with the image of a traditional barn. Even if you're not discussing farm architecture, you might hear or use the term barn red in various contexts. It's a descriptor for anything that matches that particular shade. For example, I want to paint my room barn red to give it a cozy, rustic feel. She wore a barn red dress to the event. It's a great way to be specific about the shade of red you're referring to, especially in contexts like design, art, or fashion. And there we have it. Now, not only do you know what barn red means, but you also understand its historical significance and how it's used in modern English. The next time you come across a traditional barn or a color sample, you'll know exactly what Barn Red is all about. Hope you found this explainer video helpful, and happy learning!